welcome back. This is going to be um, an unboxing of sorts. Well, I already opened it. <laughs> um, of, well, showing some of the cards for the Justice League Tarot deck. By, and it's by DC Comics, DC Collectibles. So, legit DC item. So even if you're not into tarot, but you're a huge um, comic fan or DC fan, you will love these cards. I'm gonna tell you. Um, here's the box it comes in. Not the out of box is dirty, but this is. Oh, I can wreck this in no time. Uh, it came with a little bag to put it in. Little drawstring bag. It's a tight fit, though, in my opinion. So, let me just move some stuff out of the way. Alright. Shall we begin? So, here's what the back of the card looks like. So, I don't know if I'll go through all of them, but. Um, as many as I can. Let's see. The focus is crazy. Constantine is the magician. Um, yeah. So Catwoman is the high priestess. Poison Ivy is the empress. And there are some of these characters that I'm not familiar with um, at all. Aquaman. But there is um, a lot of detail in these cards. The cardstock is actually pretty thick. Um, I wish I'd have thought to bring the uh, right away tarot deck out with me, um, the original one. But this is there's a definite, uh, definitely thicker this cardstock. So. love this strength card. Uh, and he's from the, uh, oh my gosh, the Watchmen. I can't remember his name. I just know he's from the Watchmen. See, look, look at this Two-Face um, card, the Wheel of Fortune. It's a lot of detail in some of these cards. That's just interesting. It's the Justice card and you see Lady Justice in the back with Batman. Batman's Justice. <laughs> And all of the cards are illustrated, even the pips, the minor um, arcana. So. I thought this might have been Kingpin. And then my husband reminded me. <laughs> that's Marvel. <laughs> so he said that's... Um, Lex. I forgot. I, keep, I don't know why I keep wanting to say Daredevil is DC. So, like, look at that tower car. Oh my gosh. Instead of like um, a tower exploding or whatever, but you see the city in the background. Definitely. Um, I wish that could focus better. the intention of learning to work with it but I think I might um, not right now because I'm focusing on learning the tarot so I'm only using a Rider Waite deck 
right now because that's my focus so I'm actually working on through a book with exercise and everything for tarot so I'm not going to use this now but started humming this kid song that's playing in the back <laughs> like I, I hear it so much because of my daughters that it's like in my head every time it comes on especially for my youngest I start singing it because it's about brushing your teeth and you know I got her a little toothbrush because she got a little teeth now so I got her like a toothbrush and everything um to brush her teeth to learn to brush her teeth and it's like it comes with a toothpaste that is has no fluoride so it's just me like a process of learning um, same kind of had for my oldest and so every time this song comes on I sing it with her um, they don't right now but one of the things that I love about her daycare is they teach hygiene Oops, there we go and um, I really think it's when they get to uh, the classroom that's older than toddlers. Um, so that'll be the next one she'll be moving to. She just moved into the toddler room there. But the next room she'll move into, um, they teach them how to use toothbrushes, like how to brush your teeth, um, how to properly wash your hands. Um, so that there's this song, and I wish I could remember it. My daughter used to sing it all the time. So the length of the song is how long you're supposed to wash your hands. And the song teaches you how to wash your hands. You know, that you have to wash like this and like this and get in between each finger and the tops of your hands and bottom and stuff. So it's the cutest thing. Um, so I really like that. So, um, but I'm, I'm trying to get her in the habit now of learning about brushing your teeth and you know what as I looked down I realized there were a couple of items I left out of my craft haul yup yup <laughs> so. ah. I'll have to insert that song. It's like, shame on me. <laughs> I'll have to insert that clip in the video. Precious. Oh. But yeah, I really, really found this deck to be very interesting. Um, there's a lot of detail in many of the cards, like I said. Um... You know, and I think for me, because I know some of, a lot of these DC stories, I don't know all of them, like the Green Lantern, I don't, and there's a lot of uh, Lantern, uh, well not a lot, but there's a few Lantern cards, Lan or Lantern Corp cards, not just Green Lantern, but, oh wow, so there's like the Reverse Flash, and, um, but to, for me, I almost think... I would be able to learn to read these cards based upon what I know about some of these storylines and the characters and stuff. Like, I almost think like that would help me. I don't know, but I don't think this is really. I don't know. I don't think this is like right away, right away base. Um, the downside is this card does not come with. A guidebook. <laughs> this doesn't come with a guidebook. So, yeah. I kind of, well, no, I don't kind of, I really wish it did come with one. So, yes, baby girl. Hmm? Go away.
Yes, go charge your candle. You could take mine's off. <laughs> Look at this penguin one. Creepy. Oh my gosh, even my stepson was like, that is really creepy. Um, Mm-hmm. No, you had a lot of candy tonight. Baby girl, and I told you, even if you forget, you're not going to get it because you just remembered. You can have it for snack tomorrow. I learn more using the right away deck as I'm going along. I think I might every now and again take a peek at this deck and see if these or oh, what I'm interpreting from these cards match with those definitions. We'll see. Or maybe I won't even care. <laughs> I think I won't even care. I freaking doesn't have a guidebook. I can do what I want. <laughs> I work on my own interpretations. <laughs> so. So anyway, so that is the Justice League Tarot by DC Collectibles. Um, so thank you for watching.